Hi everyone, this is Lola and welcome to my YouTube channel. This YouTube video will help you learn how to find your target heart rate zone. Your target heart rate zone is the zone in which your heart should be in while exercising in order to improve your fitness levels. And again, it's called the target heart rate zone. So you want to aim to get your heartbeat in the zone when you work out. There's a formula for this, so let's learn a formula to figure out how to get your target heart rate zone. First things first, so first of all, how to calculate your heart rate in beats per minute. This is quite simple. The formula is basically you take your two fingers and you place it on your carotid artery, which is in your neck. Your teacher could probably help you out with this and count the number of beats for 10 seconds. Once you've calculated the amount of beats for 10 seconds, you're going to take that number and multiply it by 6. For example, if you had 13 beats in those 10 seconds, you're going to multiply that by 6, and you get 78. So 78 means that in a minute, there were 78 beats per minute. My BPM, or beats per minute, right now is 78. We don't want to calculate beats, your heart rate in beats per minute for a whole minute. So that's why we do it in 10 seconds. It's just a lot faster. Now we need to know how to calculate your maximum heart rate. Your maximum heart rate is the maximum number of times your heart can beat in one minute. And this changes as you age. So as you age, the number of times that it can beat per minute is lower than somebody who is younger formula for this is 220 minus your age. If I'm 13 years old, then my maximum heart rate is going to be 207 beats per minute. 220 minus my age, which is 13 years old, leaves me with 207. You can now figure out what your maximum heart rate is. Having that information, we are now going to learn how to calculate your target heart rate zone. When you want to work out, you want to work at 70 to 85 percent of your maximum heart rate. That's what we have the 0 0.70 and the 0.85 there. If I'm a 13 year old student, my maximum heart rate is 207. I multiply that by 0 0.70 and that gives me 145. Again, my maximum heart rate of 207 is now going to be multiplied by 0.85 for that 85%, and I'm going to get 176. So when I'm working out, I really want to aim for my heartbeat to be between 145 beats per minute to 176 beats per minute. But it's going to be a little hard sitting there and taking your heart rate for a whole minute and calculating that. So there's a quicker way to do it, which I will show you next. So we've got our numbers 145 to 176. But if I divide those numbers by 6, it will give me how many beats per 10 seconds. So 145 divided by 6 is equal to the 24. And 176 divided by 6 equals 29. So while I'm working out, now I just have to remember that within 10 seconds, my beats should be, my heart rate should be 24 beats per 10 seconds to 29 beats per 10 seconds. I've included a chart here to show the different age groups and also um, not just the target heart rate zone, which we are doing in our classes, but also looking at a heart, a heart healthy zone, fat burning zone, and high intensity zone. But again, we're focusing on the target heart rate zone. So we want to be working at 70 to 85% of our maximum heart rate. And if you look across the chart, it shows it to you again for 11 year old, a 12 year old, 13 and 14 year old and you can see it in beats per minute and then just under that in beats per 10 seconds which is easier to memorize while you're working out here it is again 
target heart rate zone, which I should be working at to improve my fitness level is, this is obviously for a 13 year old, 145 beats per minute to 176 beats per minute. And we've made it easier to remember by saying 24 beats per 10 seconds to 29 beats per 10 seconds. So I've left something blank here in case you're not 13 years old, you can figure it out and decide what you need to be working on uh, for the 10 seconds. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching my video and please subscribe to my YouTube channel and press like. Thanks guys.